Hey YouTube, so this is day this is day five of me doing my own braids. Let me just show you how long it is. I did not intend for it to be this long. <laughs> this long. I didn't think it would be this long because I cut a pack in half. I used um let me show you my packs. I had five packs of the Jumbo 100% Kankalon. Mine isn't even that thick. I only used four packs of it. This is one whole pack left. So this is me putting in the last braid. Oh, it feels like I've been doing this forever. So what I'm gonna do is, and I, I left the end out. Like I braided it past my hair and then a little bit longer in some areas. Then I left the end out where they're all like tapered. They're not all reaching at the same point. And um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to braid them in some small braids. And then I'm going to hot dip them so it can be a little curly. And I'm going to try to leave these in my hair for, I'm going to say a month and a half. Now, I know someone's going to be like, what? You did all that work and it's only going to be a month and a half? I can't take any longer than that and that's just for real and my husband's always like it took you it's gonna take you a week to put them in and then you're gonna take them out in a month and I'm like yeah because that's an option I have next I want to put in um, the yarn Jenny locks um, yarn braids so that'll be my next thing but right now I'm gonna put in my last I'm gonna put in my last piece of hair and hopefully I can get it in there um, so yeah, I go back to school on Monday. So I wanted I wanted to be able to go back and have my hair relatively easy to do um so I could get to school on time, you know. I go to cosmetology school and Monday will be my first day back since I took maternity leave. And I'm a little nervous about it, a little sad about it to know that I won't be here with the baby at night or the kids because I like I stay up with my two older girls almost nightly and we watch um, Dr. Quinn Medicine Woman and we just talk and laugh and pick the show apart and wait for them to make mistakes and stuff and we you know we love it we really love Dr. Quinn though um, even with all of our joking so yeah, this is the last braid, and I did my hair in braids seven years ago. Um, no one taught me. I just decided I was going to do it, and I took a packet. I bought a packet here, and I kept playing and playing and playing and playing at it um, until I got it, and I did it. You know. This time around, because it was so long since I had done it before, I'm going to look in the mirror for a minute make sure I'm even this out. Um, I got on here and I turned on YouTube. And I saw a couple of ladies doing it and I said, oh, okay, I'm going to switch it up and I'm going to try it their way. Oh, it gets tangled. And of course it's going to do this while I'm making a video. Um, ah! Stupid. Of course. Murphy's Law. Whatever can happen, will happen, does happen, and I'm so tired. It is like 1.45 in the morning. I'm just yanking at this hell. It's not my hair. Um, I gotta fix it though. Where is it at? Here it is. So yeah, I got on here and said, I'm gonna see how they're doing it. I'm gonna see if there's an easier way to do it, and then I'm just gonna do it. And let me tell you, um, it wasn't easy. I a couple of times when I was doing it, I would I would braid it and then I would just like tug on it here a little bit and the braid would just start sliding down the hair. I was so frustrated. And I just kept going and going. I kept trying and trying and trying until finally I got it right. And then um and then I just took it from there. And it was a slow, you know, it took me a week. It took me from Monday till today, Friday. Friday, 1.45, well, I'll be done. 
to get this done and um and it's because I hadn't done it in a while and I have a life I have to take care of my kids but I wanted to get on here and I wanted to finish this last braid on video so you guys could when you see me again and I have all these braids and I tell you I did it you won't be like now she knows she didn't do that I'm just kidding but yes I did do it and it did take a long time but I did it myself okay so I am done oh my goodness I'm done I'm done I'm done so this is my braids I think I'm gonna leave it this long why because I can I'm free and being me and I think I'm gonna leave it this long you know I thought maybe I should cut this because everybody's gonna be like oh my gosh how did her hair just grow like that but you know what who cares yes it's it's added into my hair but you know I did it I go to school for doing hair so I pre I feel the I don't know kind of like the victory and knowing I could do whatever I want with my hair because that's what I'm going to school for is to play in people's hair so I get to play in my own hair so yeah so here it is that's how long it is it comes it's about right here almost my belly button I can't I can't even believe how long this is and I, I thought I was gonna run out of here but it only took four packs of hair it's very thick I mean, it, it's pretty full. Um, just going to see how thick it is to put in a ponytail. It's very big to put in a ponytail. Um, but while I was braiding it, I did the outside perimeter. So I was putting it in like this really big twisted bun and it was really cute. So I liked it. But, um, yeah, so there it is. And ladies, I just want to say, I did it. You can do it. I'm not a professional hair braider. You know, I am going to school to do hair, but they don't really teach you how to do braids. The braiding is one of those things. You just got to get in there. You got to just practice, 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 and you just do it, you know. Um, and that's it. I didn't grab my very, very tiny baby hairs and try to put that in a braid because I'm not going to break out my edges like that. It's just not that serious. I mean, just I at night, I spray it with an olive oil and water mixture. I just massage it in. And then I take a silk scarf and I tie it around the edges. And then I put all of this in a bun. And then I put another scarf on top of that. So, all right, everybody, I just wanted to get on here and show you my new hair and to say, if I can do it, you can do it. Take heart. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.